I'm Anil Kumar and here is an application of multiplication. A hexagon has six sides. How many sides will four hexagons have? Hmm. Think about it and then let me know. Another similar question is an octagon has eight sides. How many sides will three octagons have? Can you tell me? And then we have a combination of these two. Explore the number of shapes you can make with 24 sticks. Okay, let's get back to the first question and think different ways of answering this. It says a hexagon has six sides. How many sides will four hexagons have? So what we can do is we can first draw a hexagon. So let's say this is our hexagon. It has six sides. So one, two, three, four, five and six so it has six sides that is for one hexagon for four we can make four of these and then count the number of sides that's one way right so we say well this is one two three four five six the other way is we can count the number of sides four times right that is to say four times six and that should give us the answer right some of you who know four times six is 24 you can write down your answer for the others we can count okay so that's the first round one two three so we started from here one so one two three four five six second round seven eight nine ten eleven twelve 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Last round, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So we get to 24. Do you see that? So that is how you can repeatedly count the sides and get your answer. So that's a good way of doing it. Now let's look into the octagon. Well, that's simple. We'll follow the same process, right? So let's draw one octagon first. So octagon has eight sides. So what I will do is, so I'll draw three first and then four, five, six, seven, and eight. And I think with this, it becomes easier to find how many sides will three octagons have. So we'll count it three times starting from here, okay? So starting from here, we'll count one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. So three times eight should be twenty-four, and the number of sides for the octagon is twenty-four. These dots and these numbers help us to keep a track of number of times we count it. Do you see that? So it helps, right? We don't have to draw three octagons in this case or four hexagons in the previous case, right? We get to repeat it addition. Now the last question is for you to figure out. Explore the number of shapes you can make with 24 sticks. Hmm. If you are trying to make hexagons you can make four hexagons with 24 sticks right if you're trying to make octagons you can make three octagons with 24 sticks right how about other shapes right so you can think about other shapes you know square rectangle triangle right or pentagon for example how many complete shapes can you make think about it and then move on to the next video i hope you are enjoying this journey of understanding multiplication repeated addition and few examples thank you